I'm on beast mode. You're on beast mode? <laughs> Bro, why are you laying on the grass? I'm thinking I'm resting. You're resting? <laughs> I did my lunch. <laughs> Pavi, how you feel, man? Very good. Huh? Awesome. Was it good? Yeah, it's painful, but it's good. It's painful, huh? Yeah, it's painful. Come on, man. That's good. Guys, remember, pain is weakness leaving your body. <laughs> All right, peace. Wait, 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 wait. Before you go, I have to. I have to give you just a little bit, you know, just a little bit. I gotta say something, maybe 30 seconds or more. I just want to give a huge, huge shout out to my brothers that came to work out with me. Uh, for some of you that don't know, uh, Praveen uh, has to be at work. He came at uh, six something to be at work at nine o'clock. Uh, he has a wife, he has two adorable children. Uh, my other one, my other brother, uh, Agnel, uh, he's an IT guy also as, as well as like Praveen, um, and he works overnight. Um, so these, these guys really, really, truly inspire me um, because they don't make excuses. Um, they didn't make any excuses and they fulfilled what they had to do uh, because they knew that it would forever be on their to-do list for that day um, and some of you guys you know I, I, I share their stories because sometimes people be like well, Miguel you you know you can do that no 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 at the end of the day I'm sharing other people's stories because I'm telling you that you have to stop making excuses you only get one temple that the living God lives in and you have to do something with it and I'm saying that to you because I know there's somebody out there that's going to watch this and is still going to have an excuse, but it's always going to be on your daily to-do list to work out the temple that God has given you. And I'm not sure who this is for, but I'm just saying stop making excuses. I could sit here and make excuses as well. I could sit here and say, man, I have to prepare a Bible talk lesson. I have to prepare a midweek lesson. I have to prepare a church service sermon. I can sit here and make those excuses. I gotta entertain people. I gotta have people over my house. I gotta, I gotta eat. I gotta cook, you know? I gotta send bus loads of emails. I have to read bus loads of emails. I have to read, I have to have my personal relationship with God to feed God's people. And I can neglect the temple that God has given me. And I'm not sure who this is for. And I know that you, if this is not for you, you can share this with somebody. But we have to take it to another level. We have to take it to another level. We have to be people that break excuses. So like I said, I don't know who this is for. I pray that uh, it empowers you, it changes you, it motivates you. Yeah, it's fun, it's humor, but it's serious. And remember, you can do it. And what you fail to master will master you. So master everything for Almighty God. I love you guys.